All right, so as you can see, I am literally in the closet. And the, the main reason is because my house is such a mess. I still don't have my um, my YouTube proper, you know, filming location set up yet. And so, yeah, this will have to do. But for this video, I just wanted to talk about my um, vintage flap collection. I have posted um, several photos on Instagram of my collection, but I've never actually done a um, sit down video of them where I have them all together and so that's what I'm going to do here and so I will go in maybe let's go in um, order of when I got them so So the first one I got is my So Black Jumbo in the lambskin leather. I got this from Sabina Lynn. Her um, YouTube is Sabina's Closet here on YouTube and on Instagram. I think her um, handle is just Sabina Lynn. So I got this from her and this is probably my favorite because I've never seen another one just like it. I've seen several mini versions but never another you know jumbo version or a maxi or even the medium sized flap. So this one as you can see it has the um, black hardware and it has black chains and the chain and the hardware are in a plastic lucite material and as you can see the grommet there's only one up here and one up here and one down here and the cool thing is that these grommets are if you can see they are um, covered in leather so this is lambskin and it is very delicate. I do have, um, you know, a bit of wear on the, on the corners. And so I don't use this one as much anymore, <clears throat> but I still love it. And yeah, when I'm not using my other bags, I'll definitely take this one back out. So let me open it here for you just to see what's inside. I have them all stuffed at the moment. Um, so inside you can see here is the, um, the CC's. The inside, oh and here is a strap that I, that I bought from, what's the place called again? Mauto.com. I'll leave all the information down below if I remember it. <laughs> but yeah, so this strap was too small or too short for my needs and so I purchased this one which has the black hardware and the, the leather matches pretty nicely. But you can see the inside is just one black hole. There are a couple pockets. There is a flat pocket and a zippered pocket in the back. I hardly use a zippered pocket and sometimes I do use the, the flap or the, um, the flat pocket rather for coupons and my receipts or you know just storing cash or anything like that. But yeah, so there is this one for you. The next one I got was, I'm trying to think which one I got next. But I think it was, I think it was this one. So this is um, the Holy Grail, the unicorn of unicorns. This is the vintage jumbo in caviar leather with the big CCs. And this is actually in um, plated in 24 karat gold. I believe the chains are plated in 24 karat gold as well. But yeah, this one is um, probably, well, I have seen this one um, previously, but I have never seen the So Black one before. But this one is the one that everybody is trying to get with the caviar leather with the big CCs. And so when I saw this one, I immediately um, jumped on it. And so I got this one from Sabina as well. As you can see, 
it is in very good condition. The main um, drawbacks of this particular bag is the previous owner, there are some, you know, marks from storage of the chains and <clears throat> So I have not been able to get those out, but originally when I got this bag, the sides were coming out a little bit, but I have been able to um, get them cinched in a little bit. And so it looks pretty darn good. Let me open this up for you. And again, it is stuffed. And on the inside, it is similar to the So Black. There is not the CCs up here, but it is um, black interior. So let me put this back in here really quickly. And now this jumbo, I have used um, quite a bit. I love it. And yeah, it is, I mean, the corners are such good condition and the overall condition of the bag is awesome. So let me put that down. All right, so the next one that I had purchased was this one right here. And so this one I actually purchased at almost the exact same time as this one. And if you have seen my previous videos about this bag, you know that I purchased this um, <clears throat> as this one was in the mail. And now this one has the small CCs and it is also vintage and so it is plated in the 24 karat gold and this one is practically in brand new condition and <clears throat> the puffs are still very nice and puffy not a mark on it it is just an amazing bag and i got this one because at the time i wasn't sure if i wanted the loud big cc's or if i wanted it to be you know, muted and subdued just like this one is here. But here, let me open this bag again. No CCs at the top here. And it is um, black interior just like the other one. And now all of these bags, they did come with the authenticity card and the care booklet. This one in particular came with the original tags. And also these um, came with boxes as well. But this one came with the original box. And so this one is just amazing. You can see the, the sides are in such good condition. Yeah, I swear nobody or... This bag has pr pretty much never been used. I never even used this bag myself because I think... Oh my god, it, it really does belong in a museum. But, I mean, so I had a debate whether or not to keep or to use this one or this one. And I've always tended to go with the big CCs because I do like it to be a little loud. You can see this one's a little bit, a little shy. It doesn't have the big CCs. But this bag is in such good condition. Oh my goodness. Okay, so my last Chanel Vintage single flap is the... XL Jumbo. You can see this one also is in perfect condition. It's just ridiculous. I mean, I don't think anybody has even ever worn this bag. <clears throat> yeah, again, just like the other Jumbos, this one is um, 24 karat gold plated. And <clears throat> this, this mark right here, it's really hard to tell. But all the um, vintage jumbos have a mark here on the CCs if it is made in France. But the um, jumbos were also plated in 24 karat gold, which is amazing. I mean, the quality, the hardware, even the, the leather of these bags are amazing. I don't have a current jumbo, and so I can't really compare the, the two. But this is just amazing let me open this up for you <clears throat> so again i have them all stuffed and so you can see this one has the the cc's up here and the inside 
is actually in that um, maroon oxblood sort of color. And let me, I've already done a comparison between the, the Jumbo versus the Jumbo XL, so I'm not gonna do that now. But the purpose of this video <clears throat> was to, sh to um, you know, show off these bags in the same video, just to show you my vintage collection. So currently I do have four. And another reason why I wanted to um, do this video, and I'm doing this right now before I have my proper, um, you know, setup available, is because I've decided to, I've decided to sell a couple of them because I do have something on its way that will replace them. <clears throat> but, and I am gonna show you the one that I am definitely gonna keep. So I'm gonna keep this one. I am never, ever, I, well, I'm not gonna say ever, ever, but I never wanna let go of this one because it is just amazing. But the ones that I am selling are this one. And I have already sold her, and so um, <clears throat> I wanted to do this video just to, you know, get her in in the video with the other ones. So I have sold this one already, and it will be on its way to its future home tomorrow. And then, I know this is crazy of me, but I have decided to also sell this one. And so, <clears throat> yeah, just stay tuned to see um, <clears throat> what I have gotten to, to replace these two. But the truth is I am selling this one just because I never use it and I think um, someone else should, you know, have it and use it. I have never used this one either, but I don't think I'm ready to get give this one up just quite yet. Oh my goodness. <clears throat> and I don't think I will ever give that one up just because that's, you know, this is basically, oh my God, I don't know. I don't know why I would never um, wanna try to sell that one, but this is really crazy of me to try and sell this one, but I am selling this one. So if you are interested and <clears throat> yeah, just, you know, give me a, a message, send me a message on Instagram or here on YouTube or email me at docluxury at gmail.com and hopefully by the time this video goes up I'll still have it available. But yeah, this is, you know, everybody, a lot of people's holy grail. It is really hard to find a jumbo, a vintage jumbo in this good of a condition in the caviar leather with the big CCs. And so this could be our opportunity to have this one in your collection. So that's all I really wanted to talk about in this video. Um, it is sort of sad that I am letting these guys go, especially this one, just because this one is in brand new condition. And you're never going to have one quite like it, um, especially with the, the vintage bags, because once the new owner starts to use this one, you know, there's, it's not gonna be in brand new condition for very long if it continues to be used. And this one here also, if I start using this one or if I end up selling this one and um, <clears throat> yeah, then it's just not gonna be in brand new condition anymore. Anyways, I just wanted to, yeah, I just wanted to make this video before I um, send this one off to its new home. So, yeah, if you have any questions or comments, please leave them down below. And hopefully I'll have um, a better filming situation in future videos. But, yeah, um, until next time, just remember to be you and stay confident. Take care, you guys. Goodbye.